All right. Hello, noodlers. Hello. Good evening. <laughs> uh, so I hear something about the starboard bird. Oh, no. It's just a mist. Robert figures he solved the mystery of the dumping flow. That vertical valve is getting stuck sometimes. Okay. I don't know. I'll take him at his word for now. But it's nice to know at the very least that uh, we can always sh shut it down or shuttle it. Shuttle okay. it on and off and it might. But anyway, it's Give nothing it new try. or particularly pertinent okay. for this evening. Sounds good. Um, and anything ship-wise, Cheyenne? It looks like they were just moving up the slope at a slightly strange angle, but it was Yeah, that? Uh, wind and current is up, so we pretty much just have the 40 meter radius. The 40 degree? Yeah, 40 degree. Um, but so can we head kind of towards two, or what does that put it as? Yeah, at? so we're, we're going. Okay, so we can continue yeah. that way. All yep. right. And then if you want to get to like the top of this, we can just back up into it a little bit. Okay, sounds good. Let's, well, yep, carry on in that direction. And what oh, direction yeah. would that be? Uh, 30, 20, 20 degrees 25. or something? 25. Roger. I'm coming up just a little bit. Apparently they've been seeing some pretty cool stuff. Some bigger corals on boulders and yeah such and such yeah i saw the acorn worm that they saw So it seems like we're all settled in at this all point. All right, so you're going to come up underneath me in a minute then. Yeah. Which way would you like me to turn? Uh, I think you go to port. Port side. Go to port. Port side. I don't know what that was. Oh, what? Oh, that looks <coughs> primnoity in front of us. You want to zoom on it? Sure, yeah, unless you're getting situated. Oh, sorry. <coughs> All right. Too far. Go ahead and zoom. So, <laughs> oh, and there's a. Although um, we did see those weird bamboos that one time. Heteropolypus <coughs> in the background. Right there. Could we zoom a bit further? Is that full yeah. zoom? So the tilt won't go down anymore past where it's at now. Actually, I'm gonna play with it. Bamboo. Power cycling. Where's the bands? Because. Okay, there we um, go. No okay. from Noid. <coughs> okay, that's good there, thanks. Okay, full wide. Calyptrophora, yeah. Got it. I second guess myself because remember that one bamboo that we saw that was I the. Know. What clade was that? That was. Yeah. Uh, 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 that had the weird, like, candelabra shape, too. Yes. Mm hmm Right. So how's everyone doing tonight? Not bad. Yeah, doing good. Pretty good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, pretty feeling good. good for our last 
12 to 4 a.m. watch for this <laughs> cruise. <laughs> yeah. Is this our last watch for this? No, uh, last, 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 no, last. No. One more after this. But got it, got it. Last midnight to 4. It looks like the last watch left us a message saying, may we May you see a whale shark, a Dumbo octopus, and a massive holotherium. <laughs> mm. Fingers crossed. <laughs> and an anglerfish. And an oh, anglerfish, yeah. yep. please. Yes, that would be nice. And a partridge in a pear but tree. But for now, could we zoom on this fish? <laughs> Briefly. Which fish? Oh, oh that fish. Yeah. <laughs> it blends in. Looks like a cuskiel. Go ahead and zoom. Oh, he doesn't want his picture taken. He does not. Nope. <laughs> oh, oh, bye. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, bye, friend. <laughs> I know, bright and annoying. He's like, quit following me, please. I just want to go home. Uh, yeah. Um, sponge to the left. But oh yeah, what is that little guy? Do we? I, um, I are we back behind it. right now? No, we're okay. <clears throat> uh, it's just out of frame over here somewhere. Uh, there. Oh yeah. There it goes. I don't know that it's. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Maybe it is a sponge. Okay, go ahead and zoom. Oh. Oh Aww. yeah, it's a sponge. Yeah. Ooh. Um. Thank I you. It almost stock. looks like the same yeah, shape. Yeah, it's wide. <coughs> those uh, it looks like a similar shape as those pot belly balsoma or pot belly eupictelids, mm. but I don't think it's that. Is that the hyalinema again? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It was hyalinema, but I couldn't quite see. But hmm. Ooh. It's a little wall. Mm-hmm. Oh, do we want to... Holothurian, do we want to do introductions? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was just waiting for a moment when... Uh, it was like you all were looking at stuff before. Yeah. Got but you. Go ahead and zoom. Well, yeah. We'll look at this real quick, and then we'll do our introductions. Squishy buddy. Mm -hmm. I just I love how, like, all the ones that we see, they're, like, all different colors. Yeah. yeah. Different colors, different shapes. This one kind of looks like a purple maggot. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> but cuter. <laughs> Don't listen right. to him. Yeah. Oh, like Good. a purple tongue almost. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know. He kind of has a little face. Okay, I don't see a face. I kind of see abs, though. <laughs> <laughs> you see you don't see a face? <laughs> no. All right. Whenever you want to. Okay, full wide. Got it. Thanks. Some synalactid, most likely. <coughs> okay. Just put the larger group. There's a little ledge there. Yeah, this is... All right. <coughs> 
Oh yeah, behind you, in the back. Yeah. Hmm. Corals here. Oh. Okay. Chrysocorgid. Uh, I guess, can we get a quick zoom on that? This one? Go ahead, video. <clears throat> Can't tell whether it's a primnoid or one of those weird bamboos. I think it's a primnoid. I think it's a primnoid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then Christ, look, let's let's give yeah. it one more second. It's actually weird uh. looking. And then uh. it's so delicate looking. Ramlagorgia. Okay, yeah, uh, yeah, it does. It has those delicate uh. Chrysogorgia polyps. Right, right. <coughs> and then a oh, some associates on it. <coughs> yeah. Maybe some mollusks. Mm -hmm. Well, a mollusk at least. I think hydrozoan I see. Do we have any more zoom there? Thanks. Oh, yeah. Hard to see. Mm hmm. Okay, that's good. Thanks. All right. Do you want to continue introductions? Yeah, we can go ahead. <laughs> yeah. So, my name is Daniel. I'm your SPL host for this 12 before watch. I'm Sarah. I'm the scientist for this watch. I'm Leela, watch lead on this watch. I am Loopy. I am the data logger for this watch. I'm Amber, the video engineer. I am Sarah, the Atalanta pilot. Michael, the Hercules pilot. Uh, Cheyenne, the navigator. Why is that a fish? Or is that just sand at the bottom middle of the frame? Bottom middle? Uh, it just went out of I frame. I didn't see it. It's probably just sand, but it looks awfully fish shaped. <laughs> <laughs> it looks a little fishy. <laughs> a sandy fish. Right. It's. Oh. Right there. Oh, oh that's it's just oh sand. Oh my gosh. But you yeah. see, we all see the eyes, right? That we looks all like a, um, what's it called? Flounder? No. Um, oh my gosh. I see nothing. No. Uh, the it's a type fish. of crab with a face on it. Uh, horseshoe crab. It looks like a, the back of a horseshoe uh -huh. crab with a face on it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, just sand. Yeah. Horseshoe crabs are actually arachnids. Yes, fact. actually. So true. Uh, and they, they have blue arthropod. blood. Yeah. They have Earth blue blood. Pod. They must be cops. They must be cops. Well. <laughs> Makes me think of that TV show, Blue Bloods. That's one way to put it. Okay. <laughs> they are crushing Daniel's oh. spirit right now. <laughs> <laughs> Where do we find horseshoe crabs in the ocean? Are they mostly in, like, shallower areas? Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Shorelines. Yep. If you live in Florida, you probably see a lot of them around. Mm -hmm. um, There's some in Hawaii. There's some oh. on the east coast of the United States as well. Yeah, I've seen them before. Yep. yep. There was this one time I was, I went to the beach for a trip with school, and mm -hmm. we found one on its back turned on a, on a beach and oh. all the girls ran away and I just <laughs> walked up to it and I just flipped oh, it over. another little oh. sponge. Could we look at this little sponge over there? Sorry, we're late with our... That's hard to see. It's yeah. I'm going to swear there was a stocked sponge there. there is, oh yeah, yeah there it is. is. It looks like a little sack of calyx. Yeah. Go ahead and zoom. <coughs> little one. Yeah. Hey. Think little Saco yep. Calyx. Cute. That's good there. Thank you. Yep. Careful wide.
Are you good if I recite your DVL? Yeah, go ahead. Here, let me. Just the first part. There you go. Should be better. There's a lot of like C's. Yes, a lot of C's. Can you click it again? Lots of C's. <laughs> <laughs> it is a lot of C's. <laughs> it's like two, I put like three. <laughs> <laughs> Noticing any current Hannaford? Like yeah, there's some like um, coming out of the east, sort of northeast. You can see how it's taking the tether. Yeah. Off oh, the side. okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Eastish is right. Yep. I always wonder, you know, what's how is the bio different on each of these sides? No. How does the current influence that? Even of this little mound, That's you, why you know, really we're over here on the south, southeast, but what's what's the eastern face like? What's the western face like? That's why I really wish we had some way to measure current, but... Yeah, but I mean, even just being able to see it, it'd be cool if we could yeah. look at all sides of a feature on one dive. Mm-hmm. Or a few. Yeah. We could spend a whole month just on one seamount. Yeah. Really get to know that seamount. Right. Got to decide, like, do we really want to get to know a few seamounts? Do we want to sort of get to know more seamounts? What's more useful for extrapolation? Right. Guess we just got to keep doing cruises out yeah. here. Oh, I think that's probably just a shrimp, but oh. it's like, it's red. <laughs> it's red. <laughs> it's something. What are you talking about, Adam? I was like, there's big corals everywhere. <laughs> 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 oh, there was another um, Calyptrophora right. in the still cam oh, yeah. that we didn't see. Yeah. He was right about the boulders. <laughs> <laughs> But where's the girls? It's okay, they'll come, our time will come. <laughs> Maybe he's just distracted by the boulders. I think so, that was like, <laughs> that was like the first thing he said. <laughs> he was like, there's a bunch of boulders. And he was like, oh, and then there's corals. <laughs> and it's funny because they got one sample and it's a rock. <laughs> <laughs> it's not so just like, any rock. It's a boulder. Hey, you never know. It could be a meg tooth. Ooh. Maybe. That'd be cool. Big rock face here. Or maybe yeah, there might just be wow. a big boulder, but it looks looks big and overhanging. Or not overhanging. Very uh, cool. Steep. For the rock that they collected, the description is corny corny corn candy shape. Corn candy corn. shape. Yeah. Candy corn? <laughs> yeah. Candy uh, corn I, I think this is, I, I, Yeah. Poor <laughs> Paula. <laughs> She's like, I don't know what that is. Because <laughs> that's why I was struggling to read it. Because I was like, <laughs> we're going to fix it. <laughs> she did her best. <laughs> she did. Now I want candy corn. Why did you have to say that? Oh, I don't know. Candy Nothing corn. will no, make me want never. candy corn. Never. Yeah. Never. Boo. That's sad. Candy corn. I'm sorry. This no. is an interesting rock face here. It is. 
Well, that's very, huh. um, yeah, very interestingly shaped. It looks like it's kind of uh, runny almost. Right. It like almost looks conglomerate. Oh, like it's like a bunch of cemented boulders, but I don't think that that's what it is. Ooh, right. Wow. Ooh. And it gets really weird looking off yeah. in the front there. Oh, wow. It like. Oh, wow. Yeah. Uh, if I'm perceiving that correctly, is like jagged kind of. These are incredible Argus hmm. shots. But no corals that we can see. <laughs> that's okay, that's okay. We're admiring the geology right now. True. Okay. Can't tell if that's just broken rock or... An embrace yeah, or if it is broken rock, rock that's still interesting there's to look at. Go ahead and zoom. Why is it broken? Well, and also just what does the inside look like? Yeah. <laughs> Well, it is not the original basalt. It's something Else. sedimentary or highly altered or both, I guess. Oh, a little lobster. Or at? Uh, down at the bottom. Just out of well, let's look at yeah. the lobster. I don't see it. Yeah, there it is. Sure, it's oh there, yeah, though. Cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah, a little squat lobster. Nice. Where? I still don't know. Right here. I think oh, Immunadops. Hey, it Immunadops it. Squat Lobster, maybe. That was like, I don't like Sarah, where? All right. uh, full Thanks. wide. We're going to have to move on. Yep, sure. Okay. But the oh, rock feature wow, is amazing. That rock feature yeah, we're going to miss it if we stick Whoa. around here. Well, we don't want to miss it, especially yeah. not the cor or the Was that a coral on right now? Yeah, to the right. Sponge little or little something. Sponge. Yeah. I just said sporal. Oh, and an already gorgia coral. There's both. Do we want to stop the ship and explore this feature a um, little longer? Yeah, let's let's admire it for a second. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's definitely something. Oh, there's nice long, nice long coral off it, and then whatever that white one is. Yeah, sponge. sponge at top. Wow, wow. They're come up. They're oh, coming, coming up. up yeah. yeah. Look at the rocks just sitting really politely on that one ledge. I know. It's like, please sample me. <laughs> Rock sample, maybe? Mm, no. <laughs> wow, that is such a cool feature. And it's so steep wow. over here, too. True. I don't know, there's something about seeing these steep cliffs underwater yeah. and like you're it, just looking around uh, the corners. Coming up dark. there, that's very yep, close to that land. Real close. We'll yeah. come back for this after we stop sure. off if we can or we'll yeah, move the ship around. Span up for yeah. a second and see. The the ship stopped, but we can back up if that would help. Uh yeah, you might as well Still call it in because yeah. we're gonna yeah. have to back away. Yeah, that's right there. Wow, it's so close. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm oh gonna come God. up a little faster. <laughs> Just to make sure. Wow. Well, if you really want a close-up view. Oh, that's where it's really nice. <laughs> It's beautiful. Oh, there's another sponge on top it's there. really close. I'm gonna just keep... Way too close. Keep going up, keep going up. Yeah, keep going up. Okay. Starting to break there. Yeah. There's a sponge. <laughs> yep. Sponge boy. Come on. Oops. Yeah. Sorry. Wow. That was super close. Yep. Yeah, that was. All right. Now it's back fast. off now. Mm -hmm. I started the ship in the opposite okay. direction. Um, oh, that's better. What way did you move it? Uh, 205. So directly opposite. All right. The bridge is a little uncertain if this direction will hold, but I only put in 20 meters. Okay. This is 
the Sacco Calyx only area. <laughs> Very exclusive. Truly. Truly. Uh, zoom in. Oh, yeah. Wow. Look at its osculum. So defined. Yeah, that's So beautiful. detailed. Mm -hmm. Ooh. So pretty. All right, whenever you want to. We can do a nice zoom. If you're out, we're waiting. Wow. So geometric. Do we want to go like where Herc is now or further down, further back? Um, I, it would be nice if we could get back to the same spot that we were at before safely. Okay. Yeah, if we could go back down. Uh, ship seems to be doing okay. So I added another twenty meters. We'll get there. We're still pretty deep, so the laybacks, um, still pretty, pretty big. Ah, oh, dang. For uh, for time's sake, since we are pretty deep, it will be easier if you see something or a place you might want to stop or might want to sample just to stop the ship immediately, then it'll just save time versus uh, the ship going backwards. Yep. What is that brown? That's all just exposed broken rock, I guess. So that's what's going on in there. Which is not what you would think from the outside, but... Do you think Adam would want a rock from here? No. no. He wants one from near the summit, but I also think he's going to be disappointed by this rock. I don't Got think it. this is what he was hoping for, but we can, we will collect one from up top. Um, some coral here. That looks dead. Maybe this. That also looks dead. Man, those dead. Tough there. crowd. Oh, some there's to a the right. There's a live stock. coral. Yeah. Huh? Maybe. Nope. Not live. Nope. Never mind. Also dead. I wonder what happened. You're doing so well. There's more of this feature. Hey, um, Cheyenne, I didn't realize it was going to take this many moves to back up and make that safe, so we don't need to call that in. You can cancel that. We will. Oh, 
So we're, we, we don't want to go back to that spot? We can start continuing ahead. I didn't realize it would be such a, that we'd have to move so much. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah, so where do we stand now? We're n are we right above that still, but probably still too too close in to be able to descend a little and peak? Um, well, like the the, ve the vehicle's only really starting to move now, so oh, we okay. can just go down from here if you want. Yeah. Um, I think that might be like fruitful. Like okay, let's let's peek briefly down then, and then uh, we can start moving in the same direction we were heading earlier. Yeah. Okay. You want to zoom on this first? Yes, please. Go ahead, please. It's nice to see some of these bigger Sacco Calyx. I feel like we've seen yeah. a lot of smaller ones on past dives, and mm -hmm. these are pretty. So this one's doing well. Yeah. Why is nothing else? Mm. I'm surprised we haven't been seeing more associates in them. I know. Where is everything? Hiding. It's a ghost town. That's good there. Okay, full wide. So is there a reason why like we get rock samples from certain areas and uh we don't need them from certain areas, but I think that so Yeah, let's just try and come straight down from here and see yep. uh, see what we see. All right. Some areas that um like we sometimes think might have better quality rocks. I don't know why in this particular case um, Adam wanted one from the summit, but <coughs> but the geologist has spoken. <laughs> Yay, rock people. You guys rock. Yes, we do. We're rock stars. <laughs> Wait, Loopy, did you get your rock mastery certificate? Rock no. cutting ma oh. Yes, you did. Yeah, yeah. I got a oh, rock. Did. Yeah. No, but did you get the certificate? No, there's oh. certificates. Oh, you're going to get one. <laughs> it's get already one. made for you. <laughs> I'm going to say no, I, I did cut a rock already, and um, Adam let me keep a little piece of it. So oh, I nice. have it like in a little pack. Um, I did miss cutting the rock that I picked out. Um, oh. Oh. I did miss cutting that, though, but it's fine. It was there. It was beautiful. Um, the edges were really, like, it was, like, really crusted mm. Mm. and stuff. And then, like, the inside, it was really cool. Sometimes it's, like, cutting open, um, like, salami from a deli. And you just see all the little features inside and all the breccia and the conglomerates. It's so interesting. And most of the rocks that we do cut up um, in other samples we take end up going out to uh, different distributors, well, not distributors, but museums. Uh, the rocks, do they go to URI, I they, believe? Yeah, the Marine Geological mm -hmm. Sample Laboratory at URI. Yep, so that's the University the of Rhode Island. Repository. So yeah, pretty much all of our samples go there. Geologi uh, geological. Ge geological samples. And then biological samples go to Harvard, correct? To the Museum of Comparative Zoology at Harvard, yes. Yep. Or if we have a scientist that requests something. Yeah, we have some, if we can accommodate it, we have some scientists ashore who are who are sending samples directly to or, um, you know, who have given us their own su supplies, packing and, and sampling supplies to be able to send things to them directly. But that's uh, subsamples of mm -hmm. things that we are sending to the repositories. So it's, yeah, it's an Im it's important that we send the bulk of uh, what we collect from 
most samples to uh, directly to those repositories on these um, exploration cruises. This is just a really cool wall. Just really rocky. Mm -hmm. A lot of rock. Well, I wonder how many small things are on it. Yeah. Like gastropods, like worms, other like, mollusks. I mean, I can't tell if any of this is living stuff. You could look Would at it. Would it be possible to, oh yeah, it does look like it is, to zoom on any of like these little polyps in here? Yep. If, if they're polyps and not sand, I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Still wondering what those fortune cookie things were. I know. Go oh, ahead, there's a coral. There's some more Ramelagorgia up there. Mm -hmm. And it's very hard to tell. That is just sand and ink. Goes back to the weird, weird sand. We can pan to the right a little bit. There's oh, there's here. a little something on the surface. There, yeah. And a little bit mm. upwards. Oh yeah, there's a dead sponge. Oh yeah. There are tiny little mm -hmm. tubes or polyps all over this rock, actually. I'm getting close to that ledge again. Okay, yeah, that's so that's cutting. Yep. We need to back up further if you want to keep going down. That's okay. We can keep going. Let's up go from up here. a bit, and then if you want, we might be able to cut across some oh, of it. Oh, crazy gorgeous. Get Atlanta up a little bit higher. Okay. Maybe like hold there. Okay. Uh, good to start the ship moving. You guys want to explore here at uh, all? Yeah, let's just give it another second. Okay. We'll just see what we can reach from where we are now and then continue. Sounds good. I want to put a quick plug in for the Nautilus Live Instagram page. I'm mm. going to be running it today. So if you're interested in navigation or uh, the service academies, give it a look. So you can kind of turn to face nice. the slope yeah, a bit yeah. and it might get a better shot there. Take over. Yeah. Woohoo. Wow, that wall. Wow. Ow. It's like a big boat there just hanging on the ledge. It does sort of look precarious, knowing what the crumbly inside of all those rocks. Oh, there's a Rigadrella oh. anemone. Ooh. That's beautiful. Riga, you mean? Sorry, Rel uh, Relicanthus. Oh. <laughs> Go ahead and zoom. Relicanthus. Uh -huh. Oh, that's pretty. Love these. What's your routine, girl? <laughs> <laughs> so pretty. Yeah. Oh, getting good still cam shot. Mm -hmm. Um, Amber, can I get the still cam up in that little gauge spot there? Yeah, sure thing. Oops. I think. I think we got some good ones. Take a second. It's all right. Yep. All right, all good. Ooh, okay. uh, all right, full wide. Thanks. Pretty. Ooh. Ah. Is there a crinoid here on the end of that stock? That anemone also had a bunch of associates on it. Oh, really? Yeah. Look at these. Yeah, like little little wormy looking things mollusks. yeah very neat oh there's a uh, some yeah yeah i think Let's there's a kind on the end of that one of the purple 
Sathra Metra is, I think, what that group is. Oh, yeah. That's one of the specific ones, yeah. That's pretty big, too. Pretty. Oh, that's really pretty. Yeah, it's with the purple yeah. ombre. All right, thanks. And this is a crinoid? Crinoid, yeah. I'm going to try and pull up the name, but I think Sathrometra. And we're probably getting pretty stretched out there. No? We're down low, yeah. yeah. It's so sheer, though. Yeah, it is really sheer. So, okay. Yeah, you do want to. You want to go though. You want to yeah. wiggle around and try and get down there. Uh no, I think we can continue. That's fine. So, right. uh, I don't know. Um, it's gonna take a while for the sh for the the for Adeline to just start yeah, swinging with the ship, well. right? So might as well call it now. Yep, start it going. Okay. If you like. Do we want to do like really small steps and like let my i guess my suggestion would be to do small steps let them run out then you can explore when you're ready then call another one in instead of continuous um, it really depends what rate you want guys want to go yeah. that, that'll take longer that takes a while because then we have to wait for the swing yeah repeatedly mm -hmm. so i would just say uh you know if it seems like we're interested in something maybe ask if to call the next one or not Okay. Well, it's flattening out now too. Yeah, it's gonna. We're gonna get so to the top of the features yeah. soon, so it's okay, I think. So for at least now, if you do like point two continuous, and I'll try and stay in the front, and then if we have sampling opportunities, we'll have that bit of space. Okay, sounds good. I see another small sponge there. That looks different, actually, almost. Oh, and a big yellow stalk to the left. Oh, it's a really long. Nope, I think it's a normal crinoid. On is it a normal crinoid on top of a thing, or is it a really no, long stalk crinoid? I think that's a crinoid. I think that's a stalk crinoid. Given that the stalk and the crinoid are the same color. Oh, yeah. Go ahead and zoom. Oh, what no. was this called? No, you're, you're right. You, yeah, it is a, a normal crinoid on top of a oh my weird gosh. long yellow stalk. What? That is really odd. Or, what? no, or, oh. no, that's just another one of its arms, but it <laughs> looked like it was the, the bottom. I was about to say, its arm is just kind of. Not so doing hot. What's that? A crinoid? It is. I think it's a high, high crinid. Um, not maybe not that one. It looks a bit feathery or more feathery. You know, there's a couple. All right, we're good. Thank you. Oh, uh, maybe. Yeah, actually. Or this. I think. Well, I don't know. It doesn't have that range is a bit different. So I think, yeah, maybe yeah. It, it is higher quality. Whenever I see those yellow ones, that's what my mind goes to. The yellow ones that are not that long. Yeah, you can put it as a maybe. <laughs> So someone in chat mentioned earlier that a feature that we were looking at may have been an intrusive dike uh, between oh, what looked like two brecciate or conglomerated spots. Oh, did they see that? Mm-hmm. I didn't notice the dike. 
Yeah, for those at home. Yeah, for those at home, a intrusive dike Go is ahead, just a, a seep of lava that goes through rock, basically. Not like a volcano, but more just uh, oh. like a big seam. I was going to say, it's so big, but it's only like it's it's less than 10 not. centimeters. It's not that big. <laughs> this one has a nice shape. Mm -hmm. It's got little spikes. You can kind of see through it a little, too. Little spikes. And there's a teeny tiny sponge up above it, too, I think. Oh, yeah. Do you know what these kind of remind me of? There are these toys That's that I remember good. growing Zoom up. Things. It was like... I don't know how to describe it, but it reminds me of a toy. I think I know what you're talking about. Like yeah. the ones that um, are like tube things. Mm hmm Yep. Like filled with like liquid. I don't know what you two are you talking fix about. Fix that DBL fix. Me neither. We don't have it. I won't or put it on your SBL then. This thing. Like this, Daniel? Yep. What? Yeah. I have no idea what that thing is. It's literally just like a tube full of like water and stuff. I've never oh, seen one of those in my life. I know. Okay, yeah. And it's like a tube and you can like, yeah, play with it like that. <laughs> oh, I see. Are we good to keep moving? Uh, how are you feeling, Michael? Yeah, we're going to, I thought we were just going to go it, continuously. Yeah, is, it, okay. is it too steep or you're fine? No, no, it? it's okay. okay. All right. Do that then. Oh, is that, is that a dead thing right under the lasers? Dead thing, I think, dead, yeah. Dead something. Can we maybe look at what's dead? Go ahead and zoom. Also a dead stalk. Oh. Huh. Mm. What is that? Mm. Mm. I don't know. Looks like... Fibers. Just kidding. Looks like the bran mm -hmm. that I <laughs> <laughs> ate for That you just ate. <laughs> your bowl of cereal yeah. right there. That's what your <laughs> cereal looked like before it went through the shredder. Like, yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it honestly looks like dog food. All right, that's good. Thanks. It's huge and like hollow. Yeah, it's hard hard to tell. I mean, you almost want to be like, it's it's ge geologic, but then it's, it's totally out of place and interesting shape. Uh, 
I was going to say, maybe a coral, but it's the... not. just looks dead and still cam. So that's Do we want to look at this if we have time that's or no? It's dead and still cam. You're looking at it. It's no, nothing. But I think there's stuff on it. Or what are you after now? The stock? I think it's just opioids. Go ahead and zoom. They're just flaky. all going to jump ship like always. <laughs> flaky. <laughs> Oh. Oh no, it's two worms. <gasps> hey. Yeah. Hi, two worms. Those hey, are cool to see. Wow. Those are awesome. Love worms. Yeah. Um, Sabellids. Yeah. Some kind. Oh, a lot of different ones. That's a and cool angle we happen to have on these. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Yeah, come okay. on. It's more steep stuff yep. up ahead. Let's do it. Yep. Let's look at that. Love a good worm moment. Wow. So here's a like a thought provoking question. If you were to be in the next life born as a sponge or a coral, which one would you be? I think we've looked at this exact one already. <laughs> sponge or coral? Yeah. Coral. Um, I'd have friends. Yeah, that's it true. It does look like the exact one. I think it, According it, to the nav, it, it's different, but there's oh ABL really? drift too, so it might that, be the same. Yeah, I don't know. Hard to say. It does look the same. I remember that osculum. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, we don't have to zoom on it. Remember that time we found that weird coral a second time? <laughs> that weird <laughs> sand colored coral in the middle of the sand? Yeah. Oh, we just couldn't slurp it up. Yeah, it's okay. I'm proud that we found it. was such an it. effort. It was such an effort. But then we, we collected the uh, the orb from yes, right there, right? That yeah. was, yep. That was cool. That was great. But yeah, I think I'll be born as like a sponge. As a sponge? Oh, yeah. yeah. Simple. You're like, I'm going simple. <laughs> yep. That's what I was thinking. I don't know. Sponges are they, beautiful. They look very like modern and artistic. Yeah. I do like what yeah. you said though about having friends. I think I would like to be a polyp among many mm -hmm. polyps. <laughs> like how fun is that? You know. But then uh, there might be a sea star that'll come in. <laughs> right. That's true. Well. You have a large friend. <laughs> yeah. Oh, remember that one sea star is guts all over the. <laughs> oh my yeah. gosh. I can't wait Apparently for that picture. Apparently it's an amazing picture. I can't wait for that for picture to come years. out. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I know, I yeah, know. Just slowly digest Then the other one at the end of the walk. <laughs> <laughs> Biggest belly flop ever. We accidentally like knocked one off with the thruster wash and it really? just went. Uh, like, just <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Man, I missed all the moments. It took another 50 years to get back where he was. Bambalua. <laughs> it was so oh, funny really? the way it just yeah. like. Okay. Uh, just oh, ejected. Yeah, just a <laughs> bag of bricks. Just <laughs> Another sea cucumber. Yeah. It was that coral's Cinelacted. best day. Yeah. Yeah. Was there ever a moment where like something got majorly shredded on like live? Shh. We don't talk. Go about ahead, Zoom. <laughs> <laughs> As Oreo would say, next question. <laughs> oh. I mean, yeah, that stuff doesn't happen very often. No. I've seen a lot. Yeah. It might occasionally, but when you compare it to other methods of smashing oh, and grabbing yeah. and trawling and scooping and oh, stuff, yeah. oh this my is, gosh, yeah, this is like very, very Minimally soft touch. Invasive, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, I know from firsthand experience. All right, thank you. That sea cucumber kind of looked like a caterpillar with its wrinkles. Yeah, mm -hmm. they do. Oh, see like the circles everywhere? 
Mm, if we come across them again. See, yeah, like I do kind of see what you're saying. We're about a hundred meters from the top of this feature. All right. We're almost there. It's kind of chilly in here today. I know. It is. Which is a good thing. <laughs> yeah, rather that. Yeah. <laughs> that one time, it was just sneers getting hot in here in like half an hour. It's 90 degrees. They were like, don't worry about it. We're fixing it. <laughs> they were like sweating. The light is red. <laughs> Why does it feel like the door's open? A lot of dead stocks around. Yeah, once again, what happened? Time. Some jelly-like thing floating by. There it goes. Oh, big Brazilian Go ahead and zoom. I don't know. Is that a hermit crab? No. Won't know till we zoom. <laughs> oh, give oh, us yeah, a crab. It is. Give us a crab. The decorator oh. crabs. Cool. Hey. With a rock? I must say, so yeah. No, is, no. is that... It no, just, that's his shell that looks like No, it? it's carrying that's something that's growing on it. This is a particular, you always see oh, this yeah, relationship yeah, yeah, between yeah. these two organisms, uh, right. the zoanthid. Wow, it's a really bulbous. So nice. Got the wings. All right. Bye, little buddy. All right, full wide. So fun. Oh, there's a tiny little squat lobster off in the corner. I saw that. A little baby. The good thing about these rocks here is that they're nice and angular. <laughs> good thing they're cemented. Yeah, inside. they do kind of just look like sedi sedimented, cemented sedimentary rock somehow. Covered in crust. For our viewers at home, Ooh. this is, we're not like traveling towards the top of the geo. We're actually traveling on a tiny little bump right now on the side of it. So these are really massive. Oh. So we're, we're making all this progress towards like one little bump on this larger feature. Yes. So we're transecting around the side, not up. Uh. No, we're so this little yeah. feature is not the guillot, is mm -hmm. what uh, mm -hmm. what Cheyenne's pointing out. Even though it seems like, oh, we're getting to the top of this huge summit, it's like, you know, nothing compared to the size of the full guillot. Mm -hmm. But wait, there's more. Yep, we are going to continue after this. <laughs> Our, uh, we also passed by a fly trap in them. And yeah, that was a big one. Big. Yeah, I wonder if that hermit crab is just kind of sitting there forever. Like, where's it going to go? <laughs> you know, <laughs> precarious spot. So, how large is this guillot? Do we know? Uh, Ritagorgia. Um, I can look. Yeah, for scale. <laughs> Tiny little bump. <laughs> I 
<laughs> um, this is a messy map. Yeah, I don't wow. know exactly how to measure this, but, but yeah, that looks about right. Do. What you were doing there, yeah. What is that? That's a Chrysogorgia. Is it? Yep. Chrysogorgia. Go ahead and zoom. Oh. Oh yeah. Okay. I was like, why does it look so sparse? Um. Yeah. Okay. It's a. All right. Good here, thank you. I don't know how big those abluto can get. Yeah, but it looks not, like sparse. It's not zigzaggy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's you're right. It's not zigzaggy, but it looks like sparse geniculata. Yeah. Oops. The skio is roughly fifty thousand meters across. Fifty thousand. Yeah. Hmm. That's pretty large. So fifty kilometers. So it would take a lot of dives to get across. Hmm. And uh, for context, this dive track is only 3,200, 3,200 meters. It's a weird white line. Dead bamboo stalk. Yeah. Oh. Hmm, who were you? A lot of dead stalks. Yep. Eritagorgia. Magnus Morales. You want to look at it? Um, I think we're okay. Oh, the Magnus Morales, sure, real quick. <laughs> Go ahead. I thought you were talking about the dead ones. Oh, so I was oh, like, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, that probably was Janiculata. Uh, Steve uh, thinks a Bluto. A Bluto, he does, okay. Ooh, ah. I do love the spirals on these things. I just want to know what the evolutionary advantage is. You know? To the spiraling? Yeah. Probably alters the flow around it in some right. way. Right. That's good. All right. Well, what? So, Daniel, can you tell us what a guillot is? Word. Yeah, so it's a type of underwater seamount, and a seamount is a uh, a feature that was once an island that was above the uh, surface of the water. So these are volcanic in origin, and usually um, we find them forming along hot spots. So if we're looking underneath like a side view cross section of the earth you have the crust of the earth let's say it's the pacific plate it's moving as it uh, subducts underneath asia and along the way there are these plumes of magma that rise from oh, the mantle up to Just the uh, crust where are you looking on that rock, right? That By rock. the lasers, almost just above the it's lasers. Like above the lasers. Oh, Unless that's the Chrysogorgia. Oh. This thing? The coral? Right here? That's the Chrysogorgia that coral. Uh, Want to zoom? Uh, sure. Quick Go zoom. Ahead. I think it's more, looks more like Crisis, I think. Or just a really yeah, stout. It's, it's always so hard, or if it, or it's the view. I know. It's weird. With a squat lobster. Aw. It's all in there. Bundled up. Oh, hello. That's good. Thanks. All that uh, webbing, too. Like webby stuff. Mm hmm. I wonder what that was. Ooh, boulder. Mm. <laughs> Big boulder. Big boulder. Oh, another interesting area. So many little nooks and crannies on this yeah. thing, wedge, whatever it is. Another little sacrocalyx, more chrysogorgia. Oh, wow. Oh. Cool. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. What is this? Yeah, it's a sponge. Ah. 
Okay. So sponge and is it? Is there a possibility you, you want to sample this or no? Um, no, I don't think okay. we're okay. Go ahead and zoom. Ooh. Looks like a flower. Mm -hmm. It does. It's so beautiful. This is prime example. I don't know if you're able, but can you sponge. come up a little bit for the still cam? Bridge nav. Oh yeah. Thirty more meters, please. Beautiful. Yes, yes. Wow. Oh, some dead sponge just fell off. Oh my gosh. A dead Walteria is like falling in the still cam. <laughs> really? From, yeah. Just from above. See that? I think it might have oh. bumped the ledge there. Yep. <laughs> okay, that's good there. Thanks. Got them a little close. Yep. Gonna come up a little huh. bit. <clears throat> Another yep. Chrysogorgia. Um, another one. I think it was some kind of uretid. Yeah, this sponge is a toughie. Oh, another sack of calyx. We're about 30 meters from the top. Okay. Ooh, big Ritagorgia and bamboos over there. Oh, wow, right. yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Holy. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Holy mackerel. <laughs> wow. I think dead? But cool. It looks like a tree that I find in the woods, or like a branch. It is it a tree, like basically, a tree. isn't it? Like it's you just said huge. This is a huge a wood. big one. Oh, it's a living. <gasps> Yay! It's doing mm -hmm. really well. And what is it? Uh, it's a bamboo, and maybe if we could get a zoom on the branching. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, on one of the points where it branches. Ooh. Uh, it's uh. nodal branching. I can't quite see, so glad you could. Or it's like just about nodal. They all look like a round. Maybe not. That one's real close, but... Mm. Oh, no, it's not. No, that's internodal, but it's weird. It's like the node is right below often. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But it's probably that D1 clade again. That's good there. Thank you. All good? Yep. All right, full wide. Huh. I think maybe one of, actually it's a bit sparser. Maybe one of these actually. Kind of looks somewhat. Uh, no. I think it's like the really irregular, sparse. Yes. What do we got here? Man. Yeah. What do we got here? It looks like there's a Calyptrophore in the back there. Ooh. And some Chrysogorgia, Ramelagorgia militaris on the bottom. Okay, hear me out. Okay. And Niskin. Uh, I don't think it's quite dense enough. Okay. You want to zoom on anything? Uh, yeah, on, on those that sponge where the lasers are. Yeah, go ahead. Oh yeah. Nice and still, Kim. 
Mm-hmm. All right. Okay, yep. It's so pretty. Oh, um, is that a tunicate right here? I mm. think it is, yeah. Go ahead and zoom. Ooh, yep. Mm hmm So cool. All right. Have we I seen it? Good. That's mm -hmm. not this type, but I think it's um all these other little things like Come on. encrusting the rock. Looks like two worms. Oh yeah. It's a whole community. And other little things. Are we sure it's not dense enough for a Niskin? <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> That's good, thank you. Alright. Yeah, that there's like three corals on, on the four Oh right, coral density. Yep. Got <laughs> it. Forgot. But we are getting into, um, you know, sure. getting towards that, so maybe soon. Oh, and there's like a really weirdly shaped heteropolypus. Yeah. yeah. What? Mushroom corals, like big, all stock, no polyp. <laughs> Go ahead and zoom. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh my gosh. <laughs> so oh. disproportionate. <laughs> what happened, little one? Looks like Tahinotus. Yeah. Is that normal or did he like? Ah, uh, get pulled there. Okay, that's all, all right. good. All right, full Got wide. A picture. Looks like a Star Wars character. More Chrysogorgia, Ritogorgia, another, another tiny notice. <laughs> a more proportionate one. Oh, yeah. and a small and one. And a little one. Little, little one. Oh, it's so tiny. Now we're starting to get to the good stuff. I guess. I hope so. <laughs> it looks this like this is a really sand. cool area. Oh my god, so many is how you notice. Mm -hmm. Look at all of them. Yeah. Um, so we do, we are going to want to pause somewhere up here and mm -hmm. collect a rock. This is, you've got a lot of layback, so this is probably a good spot to yeah. stop the ship. Um, are we able to look this way? Sorry, I saw something like purple. Mm -hmm. If not, it's okay. Yeah, just quickly this thing. Go ahead and zoom. Oh, another mushroom coral. Yeah, weird, different one looking. Different oh, it's like pink. Coral. All right, we're good. Thank you. Uh, da, 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 da. What else do we see? Uh, okay, so let's see. Well, it looks like it's going to get sandy, so if we want to rock, probably need to look for it soon. Uh, none of that looks particularly enticing. Ooh, edge. Wow. Mm. 
Maybe that was kind of our best spot. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. 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 Not as many opportunities as it seems like there'd be. It's just sand now all of a sudden. Um, okay, let's go in there to that little spot, if that's the spot you think you can sample in where we were a moment ago. Yeah. Atlanta is pretty far away from here too. Let's just go uh, over yeah, where Atlanta sure. is for a second, and yep. then see what's over there, Let's and do it. we'll move back if we have to. But you know how painful that can be. No, it's I think okay. I saw we more over there. Back. I don't yeah. think that Adam is going to be so excited about any of these. We are seeing a decent number of coral now, though. And <laughs> it, it is. Ooh, look at that big third one. times a charm. This yeah. could be <laughs> eDNA enough. eDNA e enough. Yep, not that big of a drop off over here is kind of leveled out. Yep. All right. Turn. Uh, just getting yarded around here. Yeah. Come down a bit. Okay. Keep coming down. I mean, like 15 meter delta. All right. Uh, if we can, would you be able to pop an skin over here? Yeah, just on top of all yeah, this. Yeah, yep, that would be great. It's still coming down. Turn back around. And Loopy, you can just copy this description there. Or not copy, but you know, like the, the corals yeah. that are in that we can mention. Yeah. No Niskin's taken yet, right? Nope. Okay. Do six, I feel like that's easier, right? Yep. So far away. Yeah. Nice. It's not possible to get slightly lower, is it? Yeah, coming down here. Okay, thanks. I'll come down more. And then turn my heading off. Yeah. So I can stretch out. Yeah, come down a few more meters. Yep. 
So I'm pretty much right on top of the rock, unless you want. Yeah, that's me to great. That's good. All right, I'll do it here. All right, that went. Did you see it? Yep, okay. I did. Mm -hmm. Great, thank you. And Cheyenne, this is sample 181. I'm going to scoot over closer yep. to uh, Atlanta because yep. if we find one here, it's just going to be frustrating anyway. Sounds but good. look at this. Oh, it gets all sandy. Give us another fish or crab eating a fish. Hmm. Yeah, that was cool. That was awesome. It thought it, it was safe. It wasn't. We found it. <laughs> Ruined its meal. Yep. That's a weird narrow geniculata or a big bamboo. I think there was a hemicorallian we passed. So many of those tahinotis. I still wonder if they're named after tahini. They have to be. There's no way. The color, the name, has to be. Another one of those radiolarian things. So I have a joke for everyone and how cube us up. <laughs> okay. What did the horse say after it tripped? Um, um I can't giddy up. Yep. Oh <laughs> wait, really? Wow. Yeah, that's it. I'm falling well and I can't giddy up. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Umbalula, maybe an Lila has been earth. on it. <laughs> I don't know how I keep getting these. I'm like not usually good at yeah, those Yeah, truly. <laughs> I can't think that fast. <laughs> what would bears be without bees? Uh, ears. Yes. Go ahead and zoom. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Oh, it's a rock. Okay. Just kidding. You gotta come harder next I'm time, so Daniel. Sorry. Lila already knows. <laughs> <Zoom out. laughs> Is that the kind of rock you need for a sample? Looks a little <laughs> small, but I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> yeah, there's not. I haven't seen any other ones, actually. <laughs> it looks like a sea cucumber. Here. I mean, it's out there. It's kind of the out there. It put itself out there. Waiting to be grabbed. It's like, I'm here. <laughs> I don't know, maybe that <laughs> is Take our best with option. <laughs> yeah, everything else looks pretty cemented. Let's grab it, why not? <laughs> <laughs> I like that Sarah picked it out. <laughs> I thought it was something I, I don't it wasn't. think that Adam is going to be particularly excited about any of the rocks from up here. <laughs> but, um, but, uh, so he's yes. not here, so. Oh, there's a little cucumber, maybe. Another sea cucumber. Some sort of coral. Oh, there's something floating right there. Yeah. Where? The At bottom left screen, bottom left. In the pilot cam? Yeah, That's what right. is it? A little what sponge or stocked something? something. Yeah. Where? 
Yeah. It's right in front of oh, us. Oh, that's there. the umbeluga sea Oh, plan, yeah. I think. That's a coral. It's just bunched up now that we, we scared it. Aw. All right, let's get back to this rock. The yeah. one and only. <laughs> If it fooled me like that, man, <laughs> I think it deserves to come up. <laughs> Adam's gonna be like, so what made you choose this rock? Well, I thought it was something else. <laughs> <laughs> but it's like, kinda got all the features you want. Uh, kind of. Yeah, yeah, no, I mean. Kind of. It looks like a, um, like a med jewel date. It does, oh, I could really go for I know, I know. We had um, one of our navs who came out in the past with us was Suleiman, who is uh, from Oman, and oh. he would always bring amazing dates with him. Oh, oh that sounds so, so good. good. I was thinking about bringing some stuff, okay. but I just very much so underpacked. It Did looks like a, a, a it looks it, like a it coconut. Looks yeah. yeah, that's I funny. It Wait, is. it's not a rock. It's not a rock. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It is. It's still a sample. Oh. Is it a sponge? Wow. It is it's a jewel <laughs> tape. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? guys, I did what? pick something out. Yeah, it looks squishy. In the world. <laughs> I knew it wasn't just a random rock. No, it is there. squishy. I can see oh, the jaws are. Oh, we don't the want it. But that in is there. so weird. Could we squish it? Wait, is it a coconut? It almost, um, it almost looks like one. It really looks like a big Yeah, like date. you see the white coming it's out. Like it might actually be coconut. Someone ate a really big date, and that's the pit of it. <laughs> it spat out. I know. <laughs> Are we going to take it? No. Really? It's Aww. organic. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what we would but need it find for. Find out what it's it is. It's our last time, Please. Adam's out here being like, yes. I haven't taken that many samples because <laughs> I, we, it's a 24-hour dive and I don't want to fill up all the stuff. And it's, we're like, let's take this majority <laughs> with us. It, right. wouldn't, it wouldn't fill right. up. Yeah. Yeah. We still have... We'll one. always wonder. Yeah. <laughs> we we have good photos and videos. Okay, great. Right, fine, take it. <gasps> oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> All right, where's it going? Uh, let's put it on the side. <laughs> totally a coconut <laughs> They're gonna be so <laughs> Sample tray coming out. You can put a rock in on top of you it. Can yeah, blame you can yeah. put a rock on top of it. It's not that big. <laughs> Coconut <laughs> question mark. Oh my gosh, yeah. it's what fantastic. What sample number it does, is it? Uh, this would be, did you not get, did you get the first one? Yeah, the first one was 181. Yeah, Okay. and this is 182. I'm putting rock question mark samples. <laughs> Certainly not it's a rock. Definitely, uh, so let's see yeah, if it's definitely a coconut. Going a or B. It did look like it had some stuff on it, though. <laughs> so, I mean. We're collecting it for the bio on top. Yes, exactly. Perfect. Uh oh. Well. It's buoyant. It's buoyant. There we yeah, go. And it's in. Okay, say that right on there that something else can get put in there. Okay. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> something small. Yay. <laughs> so exciting. <laughs> it, you know, we can get these where we are too like <laughs> above <laughs> the ocean okay so who's gonna be a lucky person to take that out of the box we'll, we'll see you <laughs> just have to be there and argue for it you just had to be okay there. but now we do need to find a rock <laughs> <laughs> see i saw the like so we can just continue we coconut can just con maybe <laughs> we can just continue along this feature and whenever we hit rock again we'll we'll pick one up there That's yeah fine okay I can't even spell Thank you for anymore. appeasing so many people. <laughs> I, I've never had a like so a whole, really you, this whole watch be so determined. To That's go. what it takes. Unanimous. It's just we like will a please, it's our last time. <laughs> <laughs> Give You're us welcome. a coke at that time. By popular demand, <laughs> democracy has spoken. Steve said it's a woodfall. So yeah, yeah. That's the cat winning the. Like the political election, right? <laughs> <laughs> Supposed to get biology and rocks, and then somebody puts a coconut there. And which one do you want? And everybody takes the coconut. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get your kicks now and again. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Stress relief or something, right? So. 
I'm so happy right now. Is there? Oh, you're so welcome. I'm so excited. <laughs> if this is going to be my one contribution, oh, I'll yeah. take it. We don't get many samples on our Someone watch, and it's like, what did the midnight no. watch get? It's like, I don't know, some <laughs> coconut. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we usually collect good stuff. We got oh a god. deep, a deep water coconut. It's, no, it is a <laughs> wood fall <laughs> with, with highly valuable encrusting <laughs> water yeah. coconut. Yeah. Right. <laughs> we good to keep the ship moving? Yes, please. I guess. I, I don't see any rocks. No, we'll, <laughs> we'll just see what we come across. Usually those are quick picks anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. It did look like it had some <laughs> holes in it though, so maybe. Hey. There's something living in it? Maybe. <laughs> maybe. Maybe there was a stalk there. With possible bio. I mean, it definitely had stuff on the outside. I will say that. But did it? Did it really? It did. It did. It had like white spots. That's, that's probably nothing, right? Is that something? Maybe a chrysogorgid. Oh yeah, probably oh. just a chrysogorgid or sediment. I think chrysogorgid is right. Oh, it does it look is. like there's lots of sea cucumber trails around here. <laughs> They've been putting mm -hmm. in work. What's it called? Tilling? Tilling the farm? Oh yeah, they're little farmers. Just mixing up bioturbating that top later. <laughs> <laughs> Another a Bluto? Yeah, it looks like it. So many Chrysogorgids. So many different ones. Right, right here we've seen a Ritogorgia Magnus Bralis, Chrysogorgia mm -hmm. Bluto, Chrysogorgia mm -hmm. Crisis question mark. Yeah. Just a lot of Christ quoted. I feel like there were some geniculata too. Yeah, definitely. And the Ramblagorgia militaris. Mm hmm And all of our baby sacrocalyx. Yeah. Oh, you can see in your camera and still camera. Yeah, crinoid. Crinoid. Hey. Looks like Hyacrinidae. Mm -hmm. There it is. Hello. A sea cucumber. They're everywhere. I also wonder why we've been seeing like the same type of sea cucumber. Not necessarily like on this dive. Yeah. Yeah. Usually like in, we in see general. more variety, but we've yeah. seen a lot of this pink, cinelactid question mark. Mm-hmm. Oh, can we maybe take a look at this? <laughs> it's so mm -hmm. tiny. A twig. <laughs> Just a quick tube. one. Just quick. Go ahead and zoom. I'm sorry, but I just feel like someone should go back and like clip you just saying, Lila, please. <laughs> <laughs> Highlight. <laughs> it's oh. probably a tube worm that's receded into its tube. Yep. Huh. Okay. Interesting. We're good. I, I still want to know where those little, those little bulbs were. Uh, little bulbs. Which little bulbs? The little, the little spiky ones. The village. Yeah, they kind of looked like tulip bulbs. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The village. You mm. know. <laughs> so this rock edge is pretty jagged. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe there's a sign of something loose nearby to pick up. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> maybe there's what? <laughs> he said maybe there's something loose around. <laughs> She's just like, yeah, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> it's 1.35. I can't be I'll losing it already. <laughs> you already uh, have the coconut. <laughs> okay, back row. <laughs> we will not speak any longer of our woodfall. <laughs> What about right here? Does anything look loose to you? Yeah, that one in the middle, the you know, one taking up most of the screen. <laughs> Cheyenne struggling to talk. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I want to know what jokes Oriel is telling Cheyenne, because every time you finish putting a shit move, you're like, hee! <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, this time I was laughing from the previous uh -huh. conversation. <laughs> <laughs> 30, more, <laughs> 30 more, 30 <laughs> more meters at the same thing. <laughs> 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 Huh. Can we look at this, please? <laughs> uh, just spin around and kind of deal from the other side. It looks like maybe another one of those Cercopolis ones mm -hmm. we were we collected a while back. Ooh, this little wiggle, it looks like an acorn worm oh, drawing. It does hmm. look a lot like that. It does look like something slithered across the sediment. Where'd it go? Ooh, another potential bamboo. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead and zoom. <coughs> Ooh. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's got to be the same. It's a little different shape. And it's in huh. the sand. Well, but that the other oh. ones were too, the Cercopolis, remember, that we collected? The big one? Yes. Where we took the whole yep. thing? Mm -hmm. Oh, that huge and club. Yes, of us. in the beginning like of the walls. Everyone was like, Leland's yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Okay, that's we're good. good. Oh my. The shrimp posing in front of it really seals the deal. I wonder what's inside it. Little rock island outcrops here. Another sea cucumber. Another chrysogorgid. Otherwise, nothing else. What was that sponge under again over here? What were those colophus. rocks right there? Loose rocks. I'd say they're all attached. Mm. Yeah. Star. <laughs> Maybe. Mm -hmm. We still have 50 more meters across That's the top. Big to sea go. star. Big one. Yeah, we can just keep going across. Go ahead and zoom. <clears throat> what are you doing out here, buddy? Eating well? Oh, okay. This looks almost like some of those mixaster. Is it me, or um, maybe it's just like the way it's right carved in, but the, the arm is like broken? Okay, this and come down is a little bit. Oh, could you just grab some good pictures of that loop? I have some pictures as well. Okay, the that's poor arm good. Is broken. Yep. How long does it take a sea star's arm to grow back? Uh, yeah, we should be good here. That's a good question. I yeah. think that that's within a number of weeks. Mm. <coughs> Almost <laughs> looks like... I think that's a great picture. I can't tell if that's... I Do you want to poke around at any of those? Uh, Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Those do look looser. <coughs> 
Okay, I'm it's... gonna stop the ship then. Uh, oh. Oh, we're or not even. Yeah. We're fine? No, we're not gonna be fine unless I can just try and get one real quick here. We're so stretched out already. That one, oh, this one right there. If you can grab that, yeah. we'll be happy. Yeah. I'll come so. down some more too. Yeah, come down. That's right. Give us a few meters. Yeah. The sea star. So that was some kind of mix sister. I think asked the neck. I think it's this is gonna yes. work. It's gonna work. Mm -hmm. That looks. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, crumbled right away. Oh. Let's just spin it quick. We ain't gonna get better than that because that's Ask what all of this rock was. <laughs> Just snapped right off. That looks good. Got it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep, it's gonna go on top of our wood <laughs> coconut <laughs> woodfall. So no one needs to know it's there. Okay, box a rock. open. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now <coughs> I will switch that other camera real quick as well. Yep. Hole in one. Mm. Okay. Boom. All right. Oops. Um, I'm going to go ahead and reset your DVL. Sure. Cheyenne, what does that mean? Yeah, so basically the vehicles are tracked by um, sonar, but the sonar co sometimes comes out with noise, so like false readings. Oh. So we also have the DVL. So when I set I'll set the DVL to a sonar point that I know is true, and then it'll track the vehicle using uh, the movements of Hercules. Um, so that's just safer. So when they go into auto, if the sonar gives a false reading, it could send the vehicle into like a rock or something. Mm -hmm. So that's why we use DVL. Um, but if it's very rocky, the DVL, if it's very steep, the DVL doesn't work. And it's not perfect, so that's why I have to reset it a lot. Got it. It's, thanks. Doppler velocity log. Oh. So it's a dead reckoning method of, of knowing where the yeah. vehicles are. It's just like, all right, you up. went left and then right and then left. But mm -hmm. it drifts over time, whereas the USBL doesn't drift, but it is noisier. So kind of like Got split it. the difference there. Yeah. Ooh. You can use the DVL with what's called an INS and get a much, much better bottom bottom lock, bottom nav solution, hmm. but we just have the DVL, so as I said, it works for a while, and the worse the terrain is, but it will always drift, um, and then some systems will just, like, you can have a kind of a script or an algorithm to do that once mm. it goes so far away, right. to, to reseed it based on, like, you know, the USBL hits that are so close together, but we just do it manually, which is just as well, really, because it's, it's no, no major effort. Got it. Cool. Yeah, so you'll see Cheyenne pick like in the middle of like the cloud of USBL points. Well, this looks about right. 
Yeah, sometimes I'll be like, in one second it'll be probably right there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Good stuff. All right, we ready to keep yeah, moving yeah, along? Yeah, keep on moving it. It's like some little thing. Let's try and use this because we can. Oh. Could we look oh, oh, oh. over there <laughs> somewhere? <laughs> I thought that was going to be smaller. <laughs> well, <laughs> smaller. <laughs> oh, well, what's going if on with our tether? You couldn't see that. Look down with your camera again? Yep. Maybe I want to put a. Oh. Um, we're going to use that one next time. We'll try that. Let's see. Come on. We're in a nice flat place. Might have to fix this. Sarah's like, nice flat place. Can I try? <laughs> let's go. Let's see. Does it just pop out on its own? Let me come down a little. <clears throat> I can't tell. I feel like it's starting to, looks like it's kind of. Yeah, it wants to curl over. Mm. Let me put a, uh, put a, a oh, fly okay. around under you there. Uh, ship's drifting a little bit. All right, keep an eye on it. I gotta work this tether issue out anyway. Nope. Yeah. Just look up a oh, little. Oh, there we go. Came undone. Did you need a hold position for the tether? No, I don't. No. Um, there it is. No, I'm just gonna. That's good. Yeah, so I'm gonna just gonna run with the negative half turn in it because okay. it's always uh, it's not balanced exactly. So like positive half turn seems to be always a little bit yeah. wants to fold over on itself. Um, I don't think we need to hold Shan unless. Oh, you're not for us. I think she was yeah. worried about the oh, ship. Oh, about the ship. There. Okay, got it. We'll just let it reset. Get a better. Gotcha. See what this does for us. Okay. So there's rocks to starboard anyway. Ooh, the rocks are at right about the direction we're going to be going, hopefully. Maybe. We've got our one Maybe. sad rock. <laughs> <laughs> our one sad sedimentary looking rock. That doesn't look great. No. I think it. That's still, still looped over that way. Oh, maybe came undone. I yep. think so. All right. Yes, it did. Hard to see. Yeah. Nice. All right. Let's go Keep around with that for that. a while. All right. Keep an eye on it. Oh, I know, though. I think it's because I was spun oh, around. Oh, twisted back. Yeah, so. Let's see what happens now. Let's just do the, uh, maybe the positive turn was better. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that actually, looks, I don't know. Wait till we get out there. Right. Down. That's better. Yeah. That'll be better. There's a lot of current too, so I think when we flipped around, it just laid it over. Like sometimes it's not, it's not a turn, it just gets folded on itself. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. That's where it wants to be. Okay. 
And there goes the camera. It's going down. Someone in the chat asks, since we may have collected a coconut, do you think we'll put a lime in it too? <laughs> I almost started singing that early. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on with the ship? Are all right? Um, oh, we're kind of drifting again. I think we should... Oh. <laughs> Oriole says we're fine. We're moving slowly. Okay, well... Yeah, so you got to move in now. Yep, yes. Still going uh, zero 025? Yep, yep, zero 025. Okay, yeah. just um, make sure. Come yeah. down a few meters. Yep, please. I'm beating out. And our speed's point 0.2 knots. All right. Look at all the snail uh, mm -hmm. trails. Yeah, we got a lot of, a lot of Holothurian trails there. Oh, Looks wow. Looks like they've been noodling around a lot. <laughs> they could get a job here. It's really <laughs> abstract. <laughs> <laughs> what are they What are they trying to s tell us? Oh, yeah. Is that another arrow worm on the ground there? Oh, oh the acorn worm? Uh, the acorn worm. Uh, it looks kind of like... Yeah, it looks it? like... I don't know. Yeah, I think you're right. Maybe. Only Maybe. one way to find out. <laughs> Zoom enhance. Mm -hmm. Wait. Go ahead and zoom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. That's Didn't cool. know you had oh, that feature. Oh, it is, yeah. Good it is, eye. yeah. It's a different one. Uh, on the it's end of our roper. Still Not Yoda? There you go. Oh, actually, it's just a really sedimented Yoda? Yeah. Of Yoda? yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. It just has sediment on it. It's not... Not like very full. Dead. Hasn't been eating. It doesn't have a nice trail behind it. Hasn't been eating. No, nothing in its tummy. Aww. Why aren't you hungry? Hmm? All right. Got a picture. Thanks. Maybe it, I don't know, maybe it did all that and it just got tired. <laughs> I want to know about all these depressions. Uh, what are you know. all? Is it the wormies again? Who's living there? I know. What if you find out that there are sea cucumbers that just like go under? You know, they, that they would wiggle be about wild. and then they just dive under. <laughs> I what feel like wild? I saw something recently about like a fish that, that hides inside of the sea cucumbers. Wait, oh. what? Yes, it like, uh, I saw it on Instagram a couple weeks ago, but they like hang out and then literally like, it's going to sound weird, but the back end opens up and the fish actually oh hides gosh. inside of it. Wow. Yeah. It was incredible, yeah. So from the Smithsonian, it's they're called pearl fish, and they're slender eel-shaped fish that often live inside invertebrates like sea cucumbers. Um, and quote, because a sea cucumber breathes by taking in water through its anus, a pearl fish can wait for the cucumber to open for a breath and swim in. Hmm. Wow. Yep. <laughs> Man, the deep sea is weird. In a great way. Thank you, Smithsonian. Ooh, another umbaluba in the background. Maybe cal oh yeah, Caliphacus. Uh yeah, it does almost look like a Caliphacus. I think you're right. First one that we've First seen. First one of this dive on our watch. Mm -hmm. Is the direction we're gonna be heading that's already starting to slope down, no? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we should be slipping down for... Yeah. Okay, cool. We can just head straight towards three. What is that? Which heading is that? That's 
We have to, we can't we do have it to do north than okay. 25. Sure. All right, well, we didn't want to go to that sandy saddle anyway. Can we take a, oh, I was going to say there's something to the left. Oh. Um. Yeah. Is it a really big trip? trip. Oh, I forgot that was on. I'm sorry. You can zoom. <laughs> that, um. It looks like a really, let's look at it. That's like massive. We've seen some massive ones. It's like, yeah, huh, yeah. Go ahead and zoom. Mm -hmm. Right on the end of the tether again. Sorry, it's gonna be no, bouncy. Okay. Just a shrimp. Just a really huge. How yeah. big are we huge. thinking? Thirteen centimeter shrimp or something. All right, we're good. That's some good eating That's right there. Good, thanks. Put that whole thing in a taco. That's one taco right there. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> one taco. Deep sea taco. So I have a little uh, kind of doodad for you again. A doodad. Doodad. Like yeah. That. Did you know that the first French fries weren't cooked in France? They were cooked in Greece. Yes. Uh -huh. mm. Nice. Oh, nice. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Loopy, that's for the shrimp. This one. Are you yeah. thinking that? I couldn't tell. Oh, I thought, yeah, I'm thinking Aristeity, like that yeah. first one. I couldn't see the, did it have the long? It definitely had the Maybe back it's a different end. Aristeid, yeah. And I know, yeah, those are kind of all. Did it have the, oh, it didn't. Oh, you're right. I, I don't feel confident Actually, don't about know. any of it. I didn't get a good enough look, just Neither call it a shrimp. Don't use the ID. Just or just say maybe. Yeah. Yeah.